this train, it's like an overnight train from Istanbul, Turkey to Bucharest, Romania. It's a 20, 24 plus hour train ride. We arrive in Bucharest tomorrow at 7, 8 p.m. So it should be interesting. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. It's just crazy. I'm sweating so bad. Uh, the aircon is broken. We've been sitting here for over 20 hours. I'm absolutely exhausted. We have a small little window poking our head out the top just to get a bit of fresh air. The conductor, I have no idea where he is. We have no idea where we are. It's meant to be there a few hours. I don't think so. That was running pretty late. Um, it's about 4 p.m. now. We're running out of food, so let's hope we get there soon. But <laughs> it's crazy. We made it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're in Romania. Uh, crazy last few days from Istanbul here. The train travel was um, a pretty interesting experience. Yeah, I think we travelled about 30 hours on train out of like 37. Mm. But we're here in Sigishwara. It's a village famous for being the one of the best preserved medieval villages in Europe and also for being the birthplace of Dracula. <laughs> so we're going to start the morning by walking along the street and making our way to the citadel. It's so cute here, Adam. Yeah, it's gorgeous. It's amazing. Looking around this place, you realize just how old everything is. It's so well kept and it's so pretty. It's listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site and people still actually live here. That's pretty cool. We've just walked through into the citadel and in the main entrance is this 60 meter clock tower which welcomes you. It's a really detailed, artistic looking clock tower. It stands in the city as a symbol for justice. The citadel was located on top of a hill which overlooks a new town and it gives you a great view over the city and the mountains. I'm standing by the covered staircase. It's a really old staircase dating back to 1642. It's covered the whole way up and there are 175 steps. So it's pretty high up, but there used to be 300 steps, so I can't complain. 135. It's dark in here. Really dark. 138. 40. 75, 175 steps, we made it! <laughs> That's a good workout. This is the birthplace of Vlad Dracula. I'm sure you've heard of the novel Dracula. It wasn't a true story, but it was based on the prince who lived here. He's a bloodthirsty prince who had over 100,000 people killed. Yeah. Dracula also means son of the devil. And when we arrived yesterday in Romania, you can really get that feeling, that airy, yeah. gothic feeling. Yeah, mysterious. With, and the mist was coming over the mountains, and you could actually picture a Dracula living here. Yeah. We found this really cute little cafe selling only cakes. So nice. Yeah, so we chose this uh, traditional Romanian apple cake. Yeah. Sigurdsvara is a perfect place to come for a day, especially if you're based in Brasov, which is the most popular place to visit in Romania. Unfortunately, we haven't got much time here since we're catching an overnight train to Budapest tonight. So, another train ride. This is so good. 